Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, good morning. And hopefully you guys are all ready for a hopefully pretty good day when it comes to the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X restocks. We actually have quite a few locations we'll be on the lookout for. We have a little bit of rumors going on too as well. We have some pretty, pretty likely places and also some locations we'll be coming up throughout this week that we actually have been seeing people getting and receiving their stock on too as well so all around kind of a nice little good week that should be going on throughout this weekend so if you guys will all stay tuned and enjoy if we do see any more restock information we'll let you guys know all throughout this weekend and as well probably have a bunch of random various videos all throughout this weekend too as well some gaming news and all that good stuff so make sure you guys are look out for that but we do actually have some pretty good uh restocks we'll be watching for as well as also as i mentioned throughout these past few days we've actually had quite a few locations we'll be watching for too as well so a lot of stuff to go cover and as well hopefully it'll be a good weekend so make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new playstation 5 giveaway amazon links down below for the ps5 disc digital console and controller check out the brand new samsung ssds that are actually on sale right now with the links down below i use it myself for my playstation 5 we have the twitter and twitch stream down below if you guys want to follow sign up for weeble and deposit 100 dollars you guys go get free stock and free money same with that coinbase too as well as ours link down below let's go dive in the video itself so first and foremost, you guys have probably been hearing a decent bit about the GameStop itself. So we're going to talk about that on two different segments. We have a lot of other things we'll cover too as well. So first and foremost, we've covered this a lot, but GameStop is still receiving and getting stock for all of the Xbox Series X restocks. This has been available for the past few days, and at this past few hours, in the past few days, we've actually seen a lot of folks go and get their Xbox consoles. So in case you guys do want to go and check and see, just go look at the links itself or... Just give a nice little casual call and just hang out at your store itself if you guys want to throughout this weekend. We've been seeing a lot of folks getting this. We've been seeing a very consistent amount of Xbox Series X's floating around. So all around, it's kind of been kind of cool. I love been seeing and seeing all these people getting their Xbox consoles. The bundles are actually somewhat well-ish priced, like 600 something dollar price point. Not the best, not the worst, but I'll be honest, at least it is something out there for all of us to go get in our console. So you want to want good stuff, at least with that. I was wondering, I think like a $650 bundle mixed on in. We did have a GameStop drop that happened yesterday. So We've actually also been hearing a little bit of reports, too, of more used consoles showing up at GameStop. So if you guys ever want to go check on that, go look at the actual website itself. And if they have a used or returned or pre-owned console, we do sometimes see a higher influx of them showing it up right after a drop has happened. We've actually had a few folks as well tweet at me and let me know they actually had a chance to go get their consoles for it. So always cool to see that. We've been hearing rumors on a PS5 walk-in event happening soonish. We don't have more details for you guys, but at least the Xbox does seem like it is confirmed all throughout this weekend still with a lot of folks still getting their consoles and receiving their consoles so next thing i want to go and talk about throughout this video besides the gamestop quick talk is gonna be on target so whenever i actually go and see these target restocks we usually do see a little bit more stock floating around so in case you guys want to go and casually check your target stores for both playstation 5s and xbox series x's feel free to the playstation 5 consoles usually do sometimes have a very very small amount of leftover stock that you can maybe potentially go and pick up for your store very sporadic, very unlikely, but we've actually always seen that happen after all these drops in general. So nice to go and see. I love seeing those consoles overall, but very cool. We sometimes see those very small uh, as well. The last drop was kind of small too. So it's a little bit more on the unlikely side for this one, but always don't forget about the target walk-ins too. I'm sure you guys have heard that throughout the week, the Xbox series X consoles have been kind of floating around a decent amount. We also just had the Xbox drop as well for target online as of Friday. So the likelihood bumps up a lot more because some stores may even have extra leftover uh, stock allocated for those drops too. So it's probably worth checking throughout this weekend. If we see any more locational stock, we'll let you guys know almost 100%. So it's just cool to see where at least we're watching the stock and seeing all the stock etc etc so cool and good stuff as well other walking stuff the big one should be probably more on the kroger so we've actually been hearing reports now because we actually heard a lot of reports of the fred myers before which was like the sister chain that was around like the past two weeks or so which did kind of slowly taper on off if you guys do want to keep checking your fred meyer stores in the west coast especially PS5s and Xbox Series Xs, we've been seeing quite a few reports of them these past few weeks, but it kind of has tapered down these past few days. But if you guys want to casually call your store, check your store, you guys are getting groceries or whatever, when it comes to all these walk-ins, it really depends on the stores and the locations, if the employees are cool and all of that. So always keep that in mind. That's why I don't really like doing the weekend restocks too, too much, because it's kind of like, just go check and see, you know, this type of information. So when it comes to all the consoles floating around, we have been seeing those tapering off in Fred Myers, but Kroger's is actually been kind of picking up a lot more throughout these next few days. 
So we actually had a Kroger's PS5 drop, and usually we want to see these online restocks happen for these big kind of like BJ's, Costco, etc. Sometimes you do see a larger influx of new consoles showing on up in the stores. We actually, as of yesterday, did see quite a few folks as well go get their stock from Kroger's, which has been nice because these past few weeks we've been seeing Kroger's be very, very empty, while Fred Myers was getting a lot of stock. So if you guys do want to go casually check your Kroger stores, I, I highly implore you guys to. We've been seeing stock with it. We've been seeing consoles with it. More so on the PlayStation 5 side, more so on the disc too as well. Not so much PS5 at digital, but keeping you guys on the loop for that. We've been watching that a lot. So I'd probably say Kroger's will be a very, very good location. We'll probably maybe give you guys more information throughout the day or tomorrow morning if we see a lot more confirms. Or if you guys do call and check for any of these locations, send me a tweet, send me a message, leave me a YouTube comment, whatever it is, and I'll keep you guys in the loop the best we can. Like I said, it's always very various when it comes to the weekends. Not the biggest fan doing the weekend restocks. It's very sporadic, but at least it's kind of give you guys looks and places to be on the lookout for. So cool with that as well as also Myers Myers as you guys know is in the Midwest chain we saw a pretty good amount of stock as of like the weekend slash like Monday Tuesday we saw like little baby tapers on this but we actually have some more intriguing information that I believe our a contact over here from Myers store in northern Indiana has confirmed that there has been some Xbox Series X is actually being delivered for their locations. We have been seeing the various PS5 disc and digitals showing it up from Myers stores. There's a lot of stores like over 100 stores kind of just depends on the area and location for you guys. We also saw a lot of the Xbox Series S's both for Fred Myers and probably as well for Kroger's now too for seeing PS5 showing up at Kroger's. And same with Myers showing on up for cheaper. So in case you guys do want to go pick up any consoles for like $270 or so, I do also, once again, recommend you guys go checking those on out and getting those out just because like usually if you guys can get the Xbox Series S for cheap, usually it's pretty good and worthwhile. So we'll be watching to see if we get any more Xbox Series X's. Maybe we'll give you guys some heads up tomorrow. Same thing with Kroger. Oh, then also Fred Myers. although we haven't seen too many of those Xboxes floating around. But at least they are hearing rumors on it. And if we do see more confirmations, we'll let you guys know. Although I'm sure a lot of you guys still on this point are more focused on the PS5s over most other things. So be on the lookout for the PS5 consoles in case you guys want to. Now for other various things too as well, uh, when it comes to BJ's, I'm just going to go and say more of a YOLO on it. I'd rather be honest with you guys than not. We did see a few reports about a week ago. Ever since then, we haven't seen as, as much. We saw like little tapers, a little here and there for BJ's locations. But if you guys want to casually check, call, ask, maybe pick, you're picking up groceries. It's, it's kind of nice. Because all these places are always grocery stores, so it's at least like a double whammy. Where if you have to get stuff, get some wine, get some food, get some chicken, whatever it is, at least you guys always go ask the employees as you're there. But for the BJ stores, we have been seeing sporadically throughout these past few weeks. So just want to casually check for that on the East Coast. We saw perform in like New York, North Carolina, South Carolina. But that was about it as well. Always a reminder too, when it comes to the military restocks or military base, naval bases, keep on always checking your locations and going to see. We've been seeing a lot of PS5s floating around. Now for all the big tier retailers, when it comes to Amazon, Amazon has done weekend restocks before. So I'm going to keep you guys on the loop the best we can. If we see some stuff, see some stock arrivals or whatever. The PS5 disc and digitals are slightly overdue. It's been like over a month since the last drop. Same thing too as well when it comes to Halo Infinite consoles and also normal Xboxes. It's a little bit on the overdue side for that. We have seen weekend drops before, but we've been seeing a lot more PS5 uh, warehouse consoles. So if you guys want to always check the Amazon links down below, that's why I was going to mention them in the videos themselves. As well, Walmart probably hasn't done any weekend restocks, but if you guys want to keep checking, if you guys got your stock, we'll be watching to see if any more Walmart consoles do get fully delivered, because if we see a lot more arrivals happen, that means that the next restock pumps up a lot more on the likelihood side, which is always nice to go and see, so we'll keep on checking throughout that. As well, Best Buy. I'll be kind of curious to see if we see any Best Buy walk-ins, kind of how we see for Target a little bit. We'll let you guys know throughout the weekend if we see stuff. But we did just have a drop, and sometimes it seems like these consoles might have uh, ref returns in slash people not picking up their orders. So we'll let you guys know throughout the weekend, or if any stock arrivals stuff happen. On top of that, too, when it comes to the other various locations, PS Directs do not restock on the weekends. We do sometimes see email invites the uh Microsoft Store sometimes does weekend restocks. We'll let you guys know. Newegg has done shuffles, so check their Newegg shuffles. We do sometimes see online retailers such as like the Andromas and other various places like Kohl's, etc. go do restocks. Although a lot of the times too, usually the weekends are more chill and more focused on the walk-ins as well. So keep that in mind when it comes to the drops. We'll probably have a little bit more of a chiller weekend. We didn't have as many big PS5 drops and Xbox stuff, so we'll keep you guys in the loop the best we possibly can. 
But just want to say I appreciate you all so much for watching. Make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. I'll probably have a lot more videos all throughout this weekend too as well. We have the Samsung SSDs down below. Keep on checking those on out as well. We do have the Twitter and Twitch stream down below if you guys want to follow. Sign up for Weeble. Deposit $100. You get a bunch of free stock and free money. Same with that Coinbase too as well. And I appreciate you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys up on the next one. Love you guys.